the HBLB handicap chase. The film was going through pretty quickly, so I better shut up waffling and get on with it. Black Prince, David Robertson. I love Zelfra, Darren Thompson. Scottish half, Stu Gray. Fantasy Man, David Robertson. Chapter 1 and Boom Docker, Kevin Meanhan. Hawthorne, James Follis. Stu Gray, Derek Hinton. Wormhead, Pontypool Racing. That's Graham Clutterbuck. And Pace Ashton, Lord for Marty. There. Just 10 then. And into line, and away they go. And a very short run to the first huge fence. Every big them fences. And they're all over the first one safely. With a Scottish half for Stu Gray being overtaken by Stu Gray for Derek Hinton. Hmm, there you go. <laughs> Stu Gray's in the lead then, but he isn't. And Pace Ashton Lord has gone through the second. And chapter one and Scottish half. Hawthorne is after that one. And I love Zelfra. He's just the back marker at this stage. They come down towards the next. They've got 22 to take in all. They've already skipped over the first one, making their way down towards the second. Oh, and Stu Gray was down on his nose there. And at the third, he jumped it a little bit better. Well, he didn't jump that very well at all, the second fence. And Stu Gray in the lead still, though, from chapter one in second. And Scottish half as they take this ditch. And they're all safely over that one. And Stu Gray still the leader and now gone a good three lengths clear. To fence number five, that's the water jump. That's a big looking water as well. And they're all still standing. And I love Zelfra has still got a view of a lot of them from the back. So Stu Gray leads by six then. To Hawthorne in second as they come down a fence six. And Stu Gray was over that one a bit slowly. Ooh, makes a couple of mistakes there, quite a few of them made a mistake. These are the railway fences, of course. And if you make a mistake at one, you tend to make a mistake at all of them. And Amazingly, the whole field is still on its feet with some pretty shoddy jumping so far as they come down towards the pond fence then. And Stu Gray continues to lead. To Wormhead who's gone through to second. Scottish half is third. Hawthorne is fourth. Fantasy Man is fifth. Here comes Chapter 1 as they take the pond. Oh, and there's a faller this time. of one gone. Chapter 1, a crashing fall at the pond fence. That one's out of it then. And Stu Gray is the leader. And Wormhead in second. Fantasy Man on the outside of Hawthorne as they make their way up the straight. And take the final two fences in the straight. And that's going to be the second last next time. And again, Stu Grove had a bad mistake. Not jumping well at all. Wormhead is jumping well in second. As they race uphill then. And take this, it'll be the last of our next circuit. And Stu Grove on Wormhead and Fantasy Man as they take this ditch. The ditch side of it. And they're all safely over that one. And go up the sand downhill to come up past the winning post for the first time. Next time is the one that counts. So as they come past the winning post, let's get a view from the studios to know who we think is going well and who isn't. Well, dodgy start for Stu Gray, but he's going all right. He's still up there. Well, I think my money's on Scottish half. But he's coming up there. Okay, so the studio thinks Scottish half is the one that's going to do it. But, um, Stu Gray, if he jumps okay, may stay in the lead. Stu Gray will be hoping he doesn't because Stu Gray trained Scottish half, so confused he will be after the next exciting episode of SO6. And Stu Gray in the lead then from Stu Gray's horse, Scottish half in second. Then Fantasy Man is third, Wormhead is four, Hawthorne is five, and then Boom Docker. As they come down to this next one, skip over that one and all jump that one okay. Pace Aston Lord is now the tail end Charlie, but Stu Gray's the leader. Scottish half has gone second. Boom Docker is third. Then Fantasy Man and Hawthorne. Wormheads on the inside. And I love Zelfra is getting much closer. The Black Prince is after that one. And Pace Ashton Lord is just about the back marker. And they come down to the town. We're losing one there. Black Prince is being pulled up. So the pull up kick in for oh, and so's Pace Ashton Lord. That's being pulled up as well. So two pulled up then before that. Plain fence. That's what some people refer to as the double those two. They're going to take the water in a ditch and then we'll have the railway fences. And Scottish half is the leader over this ditch. From Stu Gray in second, then Fantasy Man and Boom Docker. Get back to Hawthorne, Wormhead, and I Love Zelfra. Over the water they go and Scottish half skipping clear then by three. Depending on how they jump these railways when they come up. Scottish half leads. See these three fences really close together. Going to get them right. And Hawthorne didn't get the middle one right. And didn't get the second one right either. Third one right, sorry. But Scottish half's in front. Stu Gray second. 
coming back again now. Boom Dockers back in third. Then Fantasy Man. They've just got three to jump. A pond fence, and then the two in the straight, and it's Scottish half by about three quarters of a length. Two Stu Gray in second, Fantasy Man is third, and Boom Docker is fourth. There's a big gap back to Wormhead Isle of Zelfra and Hawthorne. This is the pond, over it they go. They're all safely over that one, and now Boom Docker's come to take it up. It's Boom Docker in the lead, Boom Docker from Scottish half, and Stu Gray, Fantasy Man's back in fourth. It's probably between these four, though. Wormhead's trying to run on. They've got two more to take, and Boom Docker's in front from Scottish half in second. Stu Gray now looks beaten in third. Fantasy Man's back in fourth. Two more to take, and now Scottish Half's going back at Boom Docker. And Scottish Half jumps it better, and Scottish Half gets back into the lead again. It's Scottish Half from Boom Docker. Gap back to Fantasy Man and Stu Gray, but now Scottish Half's in the lead, just one to jump. Scottish Half by half a length to Boom Docker in second. Fantasy Man still closing, and they're going to take the final fence. Over it they go. Stu Gray is beaten, but it's Stu Gray's horse. Scottish Half is in the lead. Scottish Half by a length to Boom Docker in second. Fantasy Man back in third. Half a furlong to go. Could this be another one for Stu Gray? But it's Scottish Half. Scottish Half's going to take it for still, I think, up towards the line. Scottish Half takes it. Boom Docker is second. Fantasy Man is third. Then Wormhead. Then Stu Gray after that one. Then Hawthorne and Isle of Zelfra. And it's a win for Scottish Half. The studio got it right. Scottish Half takes it for Stu Gray. Boom Docker for Kevin Meenhan second. Fantasy Man for David Robertson third. Wormhead for Graham Clutterbuck was fourth. And Stu Gray for Derek Hinton was fifth. There you go.